Hello everyone and welcome to another video by me. You'll notice that in the previous videos that um I uploaded pertaining to my headset and how the, it did not they did not do the quality justice. Well, yeah, they didn't. This one will though. But that is not the purpose of this video. The the purpose of this video is to take a look at Chalet OS, a Linux distribution that is Ubuntu based, more specifically X Ubuntu based. And uh it was put onto um well it was recently put onto Distro Hunt and and this is a pretty good distro. I like it. Uh, Fishman loves Linux likes it. There is a Linux version of twenty forty eight here. Well, I guess if you have Android you already have Linux twenty forty eight. But twenty forty eight is a, a a popular game. Okay, now it makes sense. It's on your Android phone or iOS device. It's basically played by um. You play this by swiping in directions, but here on this, you actually um. Use your arrow keys, which is pretty unique, I guess. But that's not the purpose of the video. The purpose is to explore Shalei OS. And you will notice I am filming at 60 frames per second because I'm awesome like that. And because I've never done a 60 frames per second video, even during the time when... Uh, during the time that um, YouTube first allowed 60 frames per second video, which was in late October 2014. We spit stuff. Basically, this is all the stuff that uh, it comes with. You'll notice how this looks a lot like Windows, even though it's not. So, style changer. This, Spatry already explained. You can do your custom styles. Uh, this has a Windows 8 and 7, 8 and 10, or 7 style decorations. I want to see what the white style looks like. Look, the white style makes it look more like Windows 7. But the blue style makes it more look more like Windows 8 or 10. So, yeah, you got some good stuff on here. You'll notice that the um icons are different than their official icons. Um yeah. I mean, this comes with some good stuff. I mean, this is in the live environment, so... One sec. Okay, we're good. Three minutes in. We've got time to review, guys. We've got time. Um, so. Has the Ubuntu Software Center, of course. Audacious. Um, Pigeon, for your IM needs. XFCE. Yes! This uses the XFCE desktop. It comes pre-installed with Wine, and it also has Play on Linux if you ever need it, which of course is a graphical front end that uses Wine, our calculator that we like, mouse pad for editing stuff, notes probably also for editing. It's got some good, um, healthy, it's got a healthy amount of applications on this, and look, Windows wireless drivers in case you can't get your Wi-Fi to work or wireless anything to work really but yeah I think it's impressive that they made a P a computer version of 2048 I have it on my Android phone I don't play it very often but I do have it um, it's very popular I don't know why um so Oh, shut up. Anyway. Yeah, I, I'm I'm getting kind of annoyed with that thing that just popped up. I, I don't care about it. Um, so... This is a good distribution. I'll be completely honest with you. It's great. Especially for those who are transitioning from Windows to Linux. You will love this distribution. It 
comes with some great things and terminal beautiful terminal that kind of looks like command prompt and look you you can also kill the system monitor which is conky obviously catfish well yeah settings manager here's our settings manager we got all our settings right here all you could ever need in this one one window USB stick formatter yeah that's useful too but anyway uh, yeah you'll find a lot of buttons and whatnot that are similar to Windows I mean look Ugh. see look here's actual Windows down here and here's Chalet OS right there it looks very similar it comes with Firefox pre-installed and it's got some good stuff here. I think anyone who downloads this and uses it is in for a real treat. And this is about 1.6 gigabytes of a download, so not bad. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. I like this distribution quite a bit. <laughs> I'm just showing off the 60 frames per second. Like, ooh, look how smooth it is. Ooh. But yeah, great distribution. I especially recommend it to people switching from Windows to Linux. Or even dual booting. Like, you could dual boot this with Windows if you wanted to. And that'd be okay with me. I mean, I, I personally wouldn't do that, but you could if you wanted to. Y you'd be able to use it just fine. Or if you'd like, you can use this as your main and only operating system and just not use Windows on your machine. So, yeah. And this is a community created distribution. It was uploaded to distrohunt.org, which is a thing that Spatry is somehow affiliated with. I'm not quite sure how. Um, but it's pretty good. I like this distribution. Check it out. I'll see you next time!